You're watching Suck Professor. Hello, everybody. It's me, Hank. Welcome to Fallout 4. I'm joined by... James. Da -da -da. Hey, buddy. Hey, why do you have a garbage bag wrapped around your leg? I have no idea what that is. <laughs> I never <laughs> noticed that before. Um, that's my wedding ring. No. Okay, some of us love someone so much. I don't know, that's a right leg. Let's get a look at that. Honestly, it's I just picked up a bunch of shit from the last couple missions you and I haven't like a dirty Michelin man. Pocketed hardened raider right leg. Hmm. Well, what do you know? That's not it. That doesn't quite look that like it. Doesn't look like it at all. <laughs> maybe it's just maybe that's their actual leg. It's just a giant tumor. Yeah, it's a big weird rounded tumor. It looks like a very thick garbage bag. That is very strange. Cause it's pocketed? It's not yeah, that's weird. Well let's take that off, see if that fixes it. Yeah. Huh. Maybe it's the pockets Maybe. somehow you tr start turning into yes. the... Uh... The better question is, why is the military always so tired? What? What the fuck kind of joke are you making? Military fatigues. Oh, for God's sakes. <laughs> you piece of shit. <laughs> How dare you. I make the jokes around here, okay? Oh, fuck okay. face! Um, ever fuck a person's face? Uh, military. Yeah. All right, so James, here we go. Um, I tried to come in through the front door, and they repelled me with bullets. <laughs> Why are you laughing? So uh, who's in there? Uh, raiders. Raiders. Yeah, some raiders. The Oakland Raiders, specifically. Uh. So I need to... Um, my mission, should I choose to accept it, is to find another way in. Or go through the front door again, but with a little more strategy. Okay. I killed a few of them, and they still managed to fight me off. So... Uh, oh, should I listen to that military frequency? Do you do that? These, oh, these, sometimes. Yeah, they give you a mission. We just do that real quick. There's always something to get fucking distracted by in this game. Wrong buttons, I know. Wrong one again. Radio. Now we have to what, sit here for a while until it. No, you can. Yeah, you can just keep yeah. it on. Until it gives you me. Think a that mission. sewer pipe might have led inside the facility. What sewer pipe? The one I was showing you last episode. Oh, are you kidding? That goes all the way here. I think it might. You gotta be joking. That's so far away. Yeah. That's all the way back by Starlight. It, it does go inside one building. I don't, maybe it's not this one. This is like a money. Look how far away that is. Pipes. Here to here? No, here to here? It's, I mean, it's possible. There's long pipes. Yeah, there are long pipes. <laughs> am I right? Am I right? Huh? <laughs> High five. Fuck yeah, baby. Long pipes. Actually, my, it's true. The rumors are true, everybody. I, I'm here to confirm I have a long dick. It's 35 feet long. It trails behind me, and I frequently get it stuck in doors. I don't mean like inside indoors, <laughs> yeah. like outdoors indoors. I mean like it gets caught along the bottom of a door sweep. And it only gets erect two inches, no, two feet at a time. So it looks like a weird worm you pick up at a toy store. What would a revolving door do to it? It would uh, clog up the revolving door, and it would, <laughs> and it turns into a non-revolving door. Uh, I prayed to Jesus when I was in high school to make my dick bigger, and he listened. Unfortunately, Jesus is a bit of a prankster. He also goes by the name Ashton Kutcher, who decided to fuck me. Not literally. I decided to fuck me, literally, with my long 35-foot dick. I got it up as far as my small intestine. Which luckily is longer than 35 feet, actually, once you uncoil it. <laughs> Any comment, James? <laughs> what What do you have to say about that? Um, not much. Goddamn you know, you right. know if you uncoil all your intestines, it can go to the moon and back? <laughs> or was that, no, that actually that was your DNA. That's your DNA. I think it might be your intestines, too. It's probably your intestines. Yeah. More than likely. 35 times. So I, have, I thought I had another sniper. I mean, I have my other... Well, let's give this one a shot. The scope. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> yeah, Shit. that's going to work. Yeah, look at this. <laughs> go, hey. go, gadget fist. <laughs> I see you up there. Yeah? Bring it on! <laughs> this is why Rocky Balboa was not Bring it on, bitch! Army. See my champion armor? That's my spiked oh. elbow. It's pretty cool, huh? I bet you're jealous. I think it's an illegal boxing move. Why don't you shut up? <laughs> why don't you shut the fuck up? It's very illegal to wear spiked elbows <laughs> into the boxing <laughs> ring. <laughs> let's shoot one of these guys in the head. Do you think I have the range? Uh, yeah. Oh! Well, he now they're just, all awake. He was out taking a smoke break. And... Yeah. <laughs> Suddenly there's just a blast right <laughs> in his face. 
How do you like the weapons in the game, though? Uh, aren't they um, designed by the Destiny guy or something? What's the story there? Do you know more about that? Um, I know it's based on the same mechanics. I don't know if it was the same exact person. That well, did you're it. a very skilled or experienced Destiny player. I know you get uncomfortable when I compliment you. No, I, I play also, quite you, a lot. Whoa, we got bullet hits. We got bullet grounders. I get down. Ah, oh, what did I do? What the fuck? Oh, I hit the Windows button. Shit. <laughs> Fucking crap. <laughs> okay, yeah, that's it. That sucks. Well, uh, I hit the Windows button. Sorry about that, guys. All right, James, so you, you've played a lot of Destiny. Yep. I, I would say, the, compared to most people, you've logged quite a few hours. Yeah, I'm more you can than check, a few, yep. Yeah, yeah, you, you've done a lot. And you can check our our channel, by the way, if you're a Destiny fan. We've got lots of Destiny content, a lot of good guides and stuff. But how do, you, how do the weapon... Would you have suspected they're similar? Look, he went back to his smoke break. Uh, I wouldn't have. Uh, Guy's just like, fine. He's like, yeah, everything's good. Sorry, you wouldn't have? I no, I, I, I don't really see the comparison because I've tried going in without using the VAT system and fighting things and moving around and aiming, hip firing and all that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. And it seems a lot more clunky in this game than in Destiny. Gotcha. And maybe I'm just not using the right weapons. Maybe I don't have the kind of Fallout experience that would lead me to a path that would allow me to see the comparison more aptly. But Yeah. I, oh, they're after me. Yep. Go ahead, keep going. On. No, he just doesn't doesn't seem to have the same kind of nuance that Dustin oh, does. Oh shit! I've not handled this well at all. But then again, you take a game like this, which is true, it's on the consoles, but it's also designed for the PC. So there's a lot less. Aim far away. Assist. There you go. Oh. Go ahead. So maybe maybe that's why. Oh, there's... Shit, they're on me, James. <laughs> I'm wondering if there's you know on the console version of Fallout, is there a less weapon sway when you're sniping like this? to compensate for the fact that people are using controllers instead of... Oh, no, grenades! Ones. I'm fucked. I am totally fucked here. All right, hold on. Let's, let's pick up this, this thread after I uh, get killed. Ugh. Look at this. This is my, my battle. I'm just going to get that, give them the high ground and then run back and forth. Oh, flames. Oh, shit! They're sits that's on fire? Yep, all the time. Oh, yeah, I know that. Ah, oh, there comes one! <laughs> Okay, I'm going to give up. Do you happen to have any Rataway or Purified Water? I've got some of both, yeah. Why would I use it? Do you think I should use it? Yeah, your, your hit points are getting a little on the low end. Yeah, I know. This is a terrible fight. Okay, yeah, you're it's right. under aid. Aid. <laughs> Rataway. No, it's right. that thing Charlie Sheen. Oh boy, here likes, comes the Charlie Sheen joke. The thing Charlie Sheen likes to give to people who are in need. Oh, he doesn't see me. Financially. Look, he doesn't see me, you fucking idiot. Oh, he's turning. I like to blow up their heads. Oh, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> you ordered? Your delivery is here, sir. A blown up head. Yeah, come on. Come on, bitches. Think you could fuck with me? I got a truck. I just... Uh, I, don't, I wasn't listening to your Charlie Sheen comment, whatever it was. I'm no, sure that's it was how he likes to provide financial aid to people. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You kidding me, dude? If a, if a fucking porn star banged me, I would be giving her all my money. I don't have any money. I'd, I'd be giving her all, like, like YouTube advice. Mm -hmm. I'd, make, I'd do some editing stuff for her. If a porn... You know, come on. That's like my dream. I've made lots of terrible choices sexually in my life, and I would completely and without hesitation add to it by banging a porn star. You hear me, YouTube? You remember the male porn star? Yeah, especially! <laughs> no. Do you use Stimpaks, or do you just like to drink your purified water? You save those for later? No, I mean, every time I go back to town, I've got like 150 that's been generated for me, so I just drink them like they're nothing. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. You set that up. Are they all around this corner here? Oh, they're up in the fence. Don't shoot me, bitch. Uh, I gotta load up a better gun. Uh, you know, I'm not gonna use frag mines. I mean, are you at the point where you can just run in there and just melee them all to death? No. Are you? Yes. Of course you are. I mean, I meant that like a. I mean, I didn't mean to sound like a dick move. No, I know I mean, what like, you mean. I mean, of course you are. You've played through the whole game. Why wouldn't you be able to do that? Are they down here? No. Oh, someone's close. Oh. Yeah, you can probably kill him through the fence. There you go. My phone just went off. Did you win uh, another contest? I wish. I'm going to enter more contests, that's for fucking sure. I never won anything. That's I need to enter. Amazing. Yeah, me neither. And this was like sort of a merit based. I had to actually make something. Yeah, that you took didn't just skill. get your name drawn out of a hat. Yeah, so I was pretty proud to win it. Pretty grateful, especially now. I'm ramping up my efforts with animation and with YouTube and Suck Professor. Why do they always got to fight back? Okay. You know what? That's the last thing you're ever going to say. 
Yeah, bitch. Why can't they just give up and die? Where's that sniper? You gotta go. Yeah, no, they're closer. I saw. It. I knew they were coming. Come on, hit him in the head. Nice. The gun went spinning. <laughs> it is personal. Because I'm murdering you. But it couldn't get more personal. The only way I could get more personal is if I wrote on your yearbook, See you next summer. Not. <laughs> I mean, see you next year. Cunt. <laughs> Sorry, James. I didn't even say it out loud. Shouldn't it be uh, See You Next Tuesday? Yeah, that's the See You Next Tuesday move. Yes. That's why TGI Fridays used to be named See You Next Tuesday. Yeah. And people would say, Mom, I want to go eat some See You Next Tuesday. And she would say, what's that, Sally? You want to go eat some cunts? <laughs> Yay! And they would go and they would order one large cunt with extra cheese, please. Ugh. So on a lighter note, do you have any uh, predictions of where the story's going? Or how, how do you want well, it to go? Well, I, I, I've heard some spoilers. Ooh. Although I don't know if it's actually true. It was, I will it not was, confirm or deny. Yeah, it was one of the... I don't want to say it, though. I don't want to spoil it for people watching. But I can give you predictions. Um, I think the synths are going to be sort of that slightly lame storyline where the... Uh, by the way, I, I should be concentrating on this battle here. Um, like where they demand on getting rights and you know no Open one treats fire. them like they want to be treated like people. Stop just like every Star Trek that. episode with data in it. Ever. <laughs> right. I think that's probably going to be the case. I don't know if a game developer can resist the temptation to tell that story. Mm -hmm. What else are you going to do, you know? <laughs> what else are you going to do? Um, ah, she had a guy grenade. Why am I going up? Um. I feel like I'm entering Joker's castle. <laughs> yeah. Jesus Christ, this is... Am I on fire? Yeah, your health is getting a little low, too. I mean, what about, like, your main quest? The whole reason that you left the vault? Oh, to look for Sean? Fuck yeah. Sean, I don't give a shit about him. Little bitch, man. <laughs> Seriously, that baby can kiss my ass. He wasn't loyal enough to not get kidnapped? Fuck him. Have you been, like, collecting baby armor so that when you do find him, you can, uh, yeah. equip him? Yeah, he's got power armor. Nice. Yeah, it's a hamster ball. <laughs> I'm just gonna jam him in there. He's gonna roll alongside me like dog meat. Speaking of dog meat, where is he? I forgot I had a dog. I forgot. I forgot about him. <laughs> I just realized you're, you have no companion. <laughs> I forgot about. I literally like when you asked me earlier today. I was like, oh yeah, dude, you're right. All right, so James, come on, let's not let's not talk here. I'm blaming you. Shit. Let's focus. No, you Shit. can just run right by them and go into the door. That's why you always that's your answer to everything. Yeah, I mean, no, I want to get in. What the fuck? I want to fight and kill and be smart about the battles. Stimpack, crispy squirrel bits. Whoa, lightweight temper raider chest piece. Pocketed boiled leather left arm. <laughs> this is why you're burdened. <laughs> Shut up. I might be getting good stuff. I can drop it. Uh, yeah, of course. My car's gonna blow up. You need to get away from Oh, that. fuck! Shit! Why didn't you tell me that? I did. Oh, yeah, you did. Thank you for telling me that. That was wild. Oh, another one. Yeah, chain reaction. All right, James, let's get into this. Let's not... Um... Okay. I know you, Mr. Sassy, is confident with gunfights like well, this. Do you have a stealth boy? Yes. You I'll can use that nice to get in close quick. to get in better positions so you, you can, can take them out quickly. Oh, that's really smart. I like that idea. Time to reel them in. Where the hell are they? They're all up. Oh, oh, oh my Christ. God! <laughs> what the? <laughs> Just oh. casually walking yeah. around. Yeah. Uh, aim right. Look at him. He's all casual. What the fuck? I got one on him. Oh, because it killed him. That was bizarre. Oh no! Nope. I thought that was like. Oh yeah, I can hide in here. What could go wrong? This is where they sit and they watch their tires, their boxes, and their coolers. <laughs> <laughs> do you take all the? Do you use a lot of chems? Um, I I should, but I don't. Yeah. I don't. I never kind of go into a situation where I find that I need them. I right. never really need more, you know, 
I, damage because everything dies so easily. I should probably kick the difficulty up. It's weird. It's like it's never the difference maker, but it does seem like you should use them stuff. Yeah, I mean, they can definitely, if you're having trouble somewhere, you can slow down time, you can boost mm -hmm. your damage, boost your carry speed, enhance your stats. You can do a whole lot of stuff with Kim's, but yeah, like here, I let's... like that they're not necessary. What do I got? Uh, HP 20. Like, this is probably good use. HP 20 up AP. I mean, that's 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 yeah. not really a chem, but it, it, well, it raises your boosts, you know. One could argue that Coca-Cola is a chem. Oh, totally, totally. Speaking of which, am I going to go? Why don't you hold on? We'll end this video in, like, five minutes. Are we there yet? Yeah, I know. That's <laughs> how I feel. Whenever you're sitting with me, as much as I love having you, I feel this pressure to hurry up. <laughs> no, no, don't, don't feel that way. I, I know, I know. I know you're not doing it. You're not putting that out, and it's, it's kind of just me... Wanting to entertain you, no, not you know, not you get what I'm saying though. Like I'm not like I'm doing the disappearing thumb trick <laughs> and shit like that. I'm just saying like <laughs> like when I I already have that pressure to feel like I'm being to not be boring when I'm here by myself and I'm just a YouTube listener I'm talking to. But when in, there's a person in the room, it's not it's not. No, I get you're saying. I'm yeah. I'm having fun though. Don't worry right. about it. Yeah, I know, I know. And ultimately, what we want to do is get this channel to the point where you and I can quit our fucking jobs. And just play games all day long and be a couple of fat fucks who don't uh, who have a YouTube channel. That would be amazing. Yep. I want to get f fat and stupid and play YouTube games. Um, that would be really fun. Can you just like take your anger out in that dog bowl and flip it to the ground? Hey, dog bowl. Here's what I think about you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> take that, I Fido. Kinda, like. Angrily fling it against the wall, but you know. Oh no, but I did shoot it, and now it looks like boobies. <laughs> looks, it looks like lopsided boobies, like if Forrest Gump had boobies. Oh, he, right. he actually does. I know they're huge and beautiful, and they have AIDS. <laughs> oh my god! Well, his girlfriend died of AIDS. Did she actually die in the movie? Yeah, he's the part of the whole movie is he's crying at the grave, going, "I'm sorry, Jenna." I won't get AIDS like you, like your dumb son. I thought he buried her before she was dead, and that's why he was crying. No, oh, yeah, he, he, he put her in a spacesuit and shot, shipped her off to the moon. <laughs> Go ahead, you do it. I want to hear yours. No, he's not a smart man. I'm not a smart man. That's why I don't have AIDS. <laughs> it's not funny to laugh about that, James. <laughs> it doesn't, it's not a death sentence anymore. You shouldn't be. Ask Charlie Sheen. No, of course it's not. He has fitness AIDS. Fitness aids. Yep, and uh, what is that? Aids and people who help them with stuff. Oh, no. oh, like helpers, yeah. helper aids. Yeah, no, that's fine. It shouldn't. I mean, it's a it's very. Oh, what did I take the baseball? <laughs> baseball. I'll just take that. Well, it's for my junk jet. It should be a very uh, not safe, but it should be just sort of a condition and thing. And I think it's it's. And luckily, we have a lot of technology. However, it's very expensive, and a lot of people do still suffer greatly from it. So. Oh yeah, well, I mean, obviously, if you don't have the financial means, and yes, you're in a impoverished nation, it's yeah. very much a lifestyle hampering yes. condition. That's absolutely. True. All right, these, well, how big is this goddamn place? There's like a million. It's a plant. Oh, yeah, it is a plant. Like just like that tree we looked at earlier. Yeah. All right. As long as they're not coming at me from behind, I'm I'm good. Boy, that's bright. I know there's a fix for that, actually. There's a thing that'll take. I don't know if that's exactly what it fixes, but. Hi. Oh! No! Oh, good throw. Good throw. Oh, yep, yeah, you got me. <laughs> you got me! He's just like, fine. You can tell his dad played catch with him. Yeah. <laughs> that's why he's so well adjusted. Yeah. He's like the Kevin Costner. And that's why Sean is gonna suck at baseball. Yes. Hence all the baseball stuff. Yeah, in he's game. not gonna be able to throw any Molotov cocktails. Nope. Nope. The only cocktails he's gonna be able to throw are rum and cokes, mm. and whiskey and wine and cokes. Right, we're going. We're gonna go uh, Halo on this bitch. See, take that, bitch. That was very nice. No, nah, it wasn't like that was skillfully done. I just, I, I'm feeling like I should be aggressive and get this over with. Well, oh, we got a bright light. They found me. <laughs> they did. They were that was tracking me. Can you shoot it out? Yeah. Oh, oh, the light. Yeah. Where is it? Up there. Yeah, right there. Oh nice. fuck yeah! I hate when you can't shoot out lights. It's like what the hell? Oh, there's a guy. 
I can't see that I'm hitting their head, but I just kind of hope that I'm putting the bullet in the right, the, the sights in the right spot. I'm trying to get to his body. Oh yeah, well it's going to be your last gunfight. You see you next Tuesday. Anything good here? Gas mask with goggles. Sorry, I didn't mean to. Well, let's check it anyway. Are you just wearing a normal gas mask? One in 15 yeah. versus the assault gas mask, which is one in 15. Ooh. But it does have goggles, so. Yeah. yeah. Well, but it's weighs more. No, it weighs the same. Ah, it's the same thing. God damn. What's on this guy's body? Not a head, that's for sure. Rad X, sweet roll. Assault gas mask, greater right arm. Okay, okay, okay. Quit shooting at me. I'm searching through your friend's corpse. We're making our way up here. Ah. You know what? I have the weapon for that. Maybe this sniper will be a little more useful. See the sniping? That's the, one of my biggest complaints. Am I hitting you? Yep, oh, his head that, popped off. Yep, head popped off. Mama had a baby and her head popped off. You ever heard that one? <laughs> no. <laughs> That's a dandelion thing. Dandelion? Yeah, you know the dandelion? No. It's a flower. Well, that, I know what the dandelion That we all call a weed. But... Well, you hold it and you put your thumb under it, under the head, and you go, Mama had a baby and her head popped off. And then you pop your thumb up and it shoots the, the dandelion. The head pops up in the air. I think that's probably the most hideous and disturbing thing I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> K-I-S-S-I-N-G. <laughs> the baby's head popped off. Well, it's a dandelion. Spotlight control. <laughs> You've already blown him out. Yeah, I know. Uh, activate lights. Spotlight destroyed? Oh, it's already out. I thought it meant that that's what I did. I remember my mom used to do something really weird with a... Uh, I think it was a dandelion it or it's like a buttercup or something. Uh -huh. And she would like put it up to like kids' faces and say... Like, if it, like, shines in your face, it means you like butter. Oh, wow. Like, what does that even... I don't know. Let me uh, find where this person that's shooting at me. Oh, that, that's... Then I'll important. solve the riddle. Where is he? Oh, right there. Can I shoot through the floor? Yes. Boom. You better fall off this crate, bitch. I'm making a YouTube video. I hope we were doing this for Vimeo. Yeah. Daily motion. <laughs> yeah. Check out our daily motion video, everybody! <laughs> Blows my head off. <laughs> Alright, so your mom used to uh, say creepy weird shit about, uh, what? Yeah, I think she would like put it under their chin or something, and if it illuminated or the light caught it and it shone yellow on there, she would say, because it means you like butter. Well, see, that's what I'm talking about. That every, doesn't make any sense. But every, none of it makes sense. It's life. So mm -hmm. wait, hold on, hardened? Okay, so it's not as good. So I have the studded, which I modded myself, mm -hmm. as you can tell. But the uh, hardened... That's different than... Uh, the, oh, but leather's better, I think. Yeah, that's what I mean. That's what this mom had a baby and her head popped off thing. Like, there's these old weird sayings that just like live in different pockets Isn't in the like world. is like an abortion reference or something? No, come on. What do you think this is? It's a stillborn reference, Ah, uh, that's much funnier. Yeah, because by the time the baby comes out stillborn, the head is loose. Ugh. <laughs> I, don't, I don't agree with that Oh, I'm all the way up either. here now. It's like... Let's take a look at the city. Look at this view. I mean, once you're born, you're born. Yeah, I know. We've talked about this before. Yeah, actually. You're I still born. Except the notion of it is means that you're not moving. Oh, that is... Okay. Which is awful. That's like <laughs> Isn't that sad? creepy for me. I know. What if you just had a baby that doesn't like wiggling? Oh, bobblehead! Fuck yeah! Now, is it one you want to pick up? Uh, you, have you done the thing where you've gone around? Well, that one, that's not a stat bobblehead. That's a skill bobblehead, which means you can safely pick it up. What's a stat bobblehead? Why is that different? Well, because you can get your main stat, so if it's already at 10, you can pick it up to boost it to 11, whereas that would be impossible otherwise. Oh, right. If you are one of those people who wants to go all the way and yes, do it that way. Yes, if you're one of That's those weird That's not me. I'm not going to go tracking him all down. Whoa, is that the baseball stadium? Ah, oh, cool. I love the draw distance. I mean, you know, it's nice. It's cool that we can see that far. But it, you can kind of tell it's like little doll houses and yeah, stuff. Yeah. The totally. geometric. Yeah, it's just sort of like little shapes and structures. Yeah, it's... By the time we get up closer, it'll be like, if we get up close to that, it'll look like Tron from the 80s. Yeah. If it doesn't get better. It does look papery, doesn't it? Like yeah. Little paper structures, almost. There but was I, a very funny thing on Reddit once where it was... Whoa, is that the Glow Lake? That's a volcano. Yeah, it might be. That's obviously in the same corner of the map. 
Sorry, what, what was that? There, there was a, a Reddit post saying it's like the most beautiful view of Diamond City from afar. And it was literally someone using a sniper rifle from a very high place zooming in on Diamond City. It was just a bunch of orbs and pyramids and just geometric shapes. And yeah. Like crap. You know, the game should be sophisticated enough to, um, you know, when you zoom in, load it up. But I guess then you can you can really trick the yeah. game by doing I this. I really, quickly. really hate to constantly harp and blame consoles for things. But do you think that it has anything to do with it? Where it's like, okay, we know we need to design this so that it's compatible on all platforms so that... <sighs> well, I'm not... Uh, versed enough in how games work to yeah, be I'm no confident. designer or programmer. Either, I would assume so. that the less data it has to load, the better it is, mm -hmm. and that if they have ways of stages bringing the data in detail at mm -hmm. you in stages, like if it had to have full data on every single thing going on in the entire world while you're walking around, it would be if it, less efficient. Maybe someday the computing power will be there mm -hmm. and it won't matter. Like it'll be almost infinite. Um, but what do you think? No, I mean, I, I, By the way, James, you know, what's, you know, you know, what do you call it when a girl uh, gets you all going, and then uh, doesn't let you get to the finish line? Um. Hmm. What do you call it? I see a ball that's blue. So yes, I'm gonna sir. Say it is Smurf gonads. Ah, uh, yes, yeah, Smurf baseball. That's... Smurf gonads. You can say gonads. Mm. You sinner. What? Well, yes. You fucking sinner. Um. What do you think about it? No, I, th I think you're dead on the money. I think this has to be, you know. The paramount importance of game design has to be fluid gameplay. Yeah. And you can't have everything. Basically. No, you can't. Well, and right, and I assume eventually it'll get better, but then as computers get faster, they'll be scaling it all up and down and whatever. It'll, you know, I don't know. It's all good. Let's just take this bobblehead and end this goddamn fucking video. You're going to repair sure. the bobblehead? What? Oh, yeah. Bingo. <laughs> Why well, go down on the ship when you can try to fix it? Fusion cores permanently last 10% longer. That's pretty awesome. That's a good one, right? That's some really good. So it was worth wandering around this whole yeah, thing. You're going, oh, why don't you just take a stealth boy and walk past them and just fuck these guys and go into the inside? Uh, well, not every adventure leads to a bobblehead. Well, but how do you know unless you search and discover? True. And let's throw this fucker off the, off the, uh, off the building. What kind of people would we be if we didn't do that is it a good drop yeah this would be a pretty good drop yeah, let's see if it bounces hopefully we've got the draw distance to see the bounce <laughs> all right bitch this is the first you and your you intestines on the outside mask are going for a trip ready oh shit nice that was pretty good yeah i love i love a good clip you know when their <laughs> arm and their shoulder catches a railing and then they gotta start spinning all right, everybody, that's all we got for now. You're going to have to come check us out on the next video. I hope you enjoyed me and James playing the game here. All the way up on top of the Corvega plant. This is a pretty exciting place to be. I'm going to I'm gonna go in on this view here. Oh, got to scale. Got to swoop them down so the camera goes around. That's the stuff. Look at that. Look at that that's beauty. Like wallpaper. That's like a wallpaper quality shot. We could turn off the, uh, the uh, HUD. Yeah. Get it. All right, everybody. Bye. I love you. Bye, James. I love you less. Oh.